Hello Gemini, how are you? Welcome to my channel, Star Star Star, and welcome to your reading. So Gemini, this is your reading for the month of April, and this is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa, and time is fluid. Okay, Gemini, I would appreciate if you would hit like, share, and subscribe. And comment down below if you find yourself getting resonated with this reading. I would also request you to hit that notification bell so that you will be notified whenever I upload the videos. Gemini, there is an extended reading for this one. If you are interested in the same, if you are excited to know what your person truly thinks and feels about you, what action they will take towards you, what is the likely conclusion between you and this person, you can go ahead and you can check out the link in the description box and the comment section. As far as this uh, video on YouTube is concerned, what I'm going to do is I will see what is your energy, I will see what is the energy of the person you are thinking about, you are dealing with, or you will be dealing with, okay? So I'll shuffle the cards, I'll lay them down, and then we'll discuss the energies. So we have six of cups for you, we have magician, ten of cups, and we have two of wands, nice. You may be dealing with Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, you may be dealing with another Gemini, you may be dealing with Virgo. Now let me shuffle the cards for your person. We have judgment for your person. Oh my God, we have 10 of cups again. Are you kidding me? We have temperance and we have page of swords. Nice. You may be dealing with Sagittarius as well. Let me show you your spread. Six of cups, magician, 10 of cups and two of wands. This is a solid confirmation about something, Gemini. Okay? This is absolutely a solid confirmation about something. And with Ten of Cups twice. Ten of Cups twice. With Six of Cups. With Temperance. With Magician. I strongly feel so many positive cards. I strongly feel that long-term commitment or marriage is is a very strong possibility for you guys okay wow i'm happy for you gemini i'm happy for you so six of cups magician then we have ten of cups two of wands in the past you were sort of you were sort of required to ask for love okay in all the previous relationships you literally had to ask for love you had to ask the other person to love you back but now going ahead times have changed and love is literally gonna come and fall in your lap okay love will literally beg you like let me be a part of your life okay so that's what I see. Things are changing. S things are changing drastically. There is a 360 degree shift in your fate. In what is coming towards you. Whatever is coming towards you. Whoever is coming towards you. It is so different than what you had experienced in the past. Okay. Like some of you literally had to beg for love. You literally were so disappointed that you loved your previous partners so much but you got breadcrumbs in return and that too after you asking them like you suggesting them why you're not loving me like i'm doing so much for you and what are you doing for me when you were suggesting that person then that person threw breadcrumbs at you but now love is coming towards you 
okay someone is going to enter in your life and a very strong possibility gemini that this is going to be your life partner that this is going to be the one for you okay with six of cups a previous life soulmate a past life soulmate is entering in your life and you your subconscious mind manifested this person okay your subconscious mind has manifested that person i am i'm hearing that your subconscious mind or your soul had a sudden awakening in this lifetime this meeting was probably not fated for this lifetime but you manifested this meeting okay meeting the soulmate of yours is what your subconscious mind manifested because anyway you have paid back lot of karma a uh, lot of you have paid back lot of uh, the debts that you had carried forward from the pre uh, from the previous lifetime you have paid back those debts okay you have paid back that karma and at the same time you have done lot of good deeds you have accumulated good karma for that and as a result and plus your manifestation powers okay the cumulative effect is that of you have manifested the soulmate okay this manifesting the soulmate you meeting the soulmate was not fated for this lifetime but you your subconscious mind has manifested it and it is a result of A result of the fact that you have paid back lot of things you have you your slate is clean okay at the same time you have accumulated lot of good karma so i see lot of good times ahead for you gemini i also see you are becoming lot of uh, you are becoming a spiritual person okay you are focusing on your spiritual ascension because you are somehow feeling the magical powers or you are you are somehow feeling that your fate has your fate is is getting shifted in a positive manner because of the fact that you are becoming more and more spiritual every passing day okay and you strongly believe that your spiritual inclination or you getting exposed to spirituality has some sort of a connection with the abundance that you are attracting or your spiritual exposure has some sort of a connection with what is coming towards you who is coming towards you okay or what you are able to manifest in your life that has some sort of a connection with your with your spiritual exposure or your spiritual ascension so with the magician card something has with the spiritual with with the magician card i feel like the importance of spirituality has been so well ingrained on your mind and on your soul that this spiritual inclination will not at all go away till the time you die okay because there are realizations that how important how important this spiritual exposure or spiritual ascension is okay and because you are sort of directly able to correlate like because i started becoming spiritual that is why i am attracting this abundance you have your own personal experience some of you are feeling that you have become a karma a karma person you have you have started experiencing lot of equilibrium within you you have started experiencing lot of emotional stability overall stability within you because of your spiritual inclination i don't know you are doing something okay you have become bit religious you are have started mantra chanting you have started doing lot of meditation you have started aligning your mind body and soul you have started connecting yourself with the universe with the spiritual world okay and what i feel is that has sort of given you a push that has sort of given you the required motivation and inspiration to become a better version of yourself and to walk down the path of spiritual ascension you have a vision for yourself gemini you know that what you want to have in your life 
you know that you want to have a wife or a husband you know that you want to have a family you know that you want to have your your own kids this is again applicable for whosoever want to have your own kids you want to have your flesh and your blood in front of you okay i mean you want to carry forward your legacy through your kids again this is applicable for whosoever want to have kids but i see you want to carry forward your legacy okay with the two of wands you are getting ready for whatever and whoever is coming your way your soul is preparing yourself for something gemini okay your soul knows that there is someone who is going to enter in your life 10 of cups 6 of cups 10 of cups twice your soul knows with the judgment card the day is not far away the judgment day is not far away okay you are preparing yourself for something with two of wands your soul is preparing you for something as far as your person is concerned gemini we have judgment 10 of cups we have temperance page of swords balance is the key you may be seeing lot of 222 -2 -2. you may be seeing lot of 11 11 you may be seeing lot of uh, number 20 is of some importance over here someone's car plate has 2020 -20. number plate number 2 is of some importance i'm getting a partnership energy i'm getting a duality i'm getting two souls coming together i'm i'm sensing two energies are coming together i'm sensing it's a merger of two souls and two energies into one single energy okay two souls are merging into one another and the day is not far away you are supposed to meet someone gemini okay it's like angels are announcing that day very soon you're supposed to meet someone and this person is not far away that's what i feel you are meant to grow old with this person and trust me i'm getting so 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 positive energy i feel like i should cry right now because that is how happy you're going to feel once you meet this person because your soul is going to recognize their soul and it's a union of two souls it's a union of soulmates and this is your past life soulmate you have manifested the soulmate in this lifetime you're like no i don't know you have to be with me in this lifetime i want you in this i want you with me in this lifetime you have manifested this person and i'm so happy for you trust me you are underestimating your powers you are a very very powerful person your subconscious mind is very strong very very strong hmm this person may be a professor you may meet this person at an event a wedding if you're a, if you're going to attend a wedding of someone else or if you are some sort of an event a conference or a, a music tour of some celebrity that's where you're going to meet this person or i don't know i'm hearing wine somebody likes wine a lot red wine okay it it is a wine fest somewhere a beer fest i'm hearing germany I'm also hearing it's it's a place where there is a bit of a humid climate so of course uh sea is quite nearby so I'm hearing California I'm hearing Bombay Australia
if you are planning to go f- uh, to some country for education i see that is uh, you're going to meet this person over there okay during pursuing your education this is this person is going to be very particular about their dressing okay there may be an age gap okay and uh, an age gap of 10 years or so uh, this person is going to be very very particular they love formals and they look very good in formals they look very smart and very handsome in formals especially white shirt crisp white shirt they look whether it is a male or a female they they love wearing formals this person works in the corporate world for some of you or even if this person has a business of their own they like to present themselves in a very professional manner okay they come as they come across as very neat and tidy okay they 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 are very fun to be around with but they take time to uh open up they take time to open up so for initial couple of days this person will be a bit formal and they will take some time to open up but once they open up this person is going to be so fun to be with wow i'm getting really positive vibes gemini i'm very happy for you i hope this resonates and hit like share and subscribe and comment down below the link for the extended is in description box in the extended we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you what action they will take towards you what is the likely conclusion between you and this person okay bye bye then